yeah i i think i did talk about it like i, I did vent a little bit of my frustration uh, frustrations about the um uh, passing of technoblade but i just thought about it for a while and i was like a little bit uh, i was thinking that maybe i shouldn't talk about it because it's just gonna feed into all this uh clickbaity you uh, youtubers right outside there because I mean, it's better not to give them any like i mean any 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 one bit of promotion or like they yeah, get to know about them it's it's been really scummy because i think i i did sh i did talk about it a little bit and saying like how you know technoblade has passed away and a lot of youtubers have been uh like smaller or medium-sized youtubers they've been posting all these clickbait videos about uh about uh his death and how a lot of uh big youtubers per se has been like reacting to his death and stuff like that and there's been a lot of people clickbaiting like mr beast face or like i don't know Tommy in it or this bunch of other big youtubers faces and it's all fake clickbaits and like fake screen screenshots like it's really it's really you, you gotta be some some level of scumbag to do stuff like that i can show you guys what i mean uh you can see it's that right now it's it's apparently even a trend to talk about his death or to have like compilations you see stuff like this shit right i think there's more like like i think like people are just constantly screen capping faces and stuff like like that streamer says goodbye to technoblade and then this guy that this guy this this guy this motherfucker right here uh bat uh brasso this guy this guy even faked a uh charity uh video per se he he said he was gonna donate three thousand us dollars for to charity under like technoblade's name or something like that i'm not very sure but it like people found out that he actually lied like he was clicking in his videos like you know donate three thousand uh dollars and then he actually he he switched out something and then he instead of actually doing three thousand he actually just donated 300 but he was still lying and saying like he donated a huge chunk of money and he was caught and then he was like oh no it's not that i didn't want to donate it's like you know i just didn't have the money you know and i just you know and then i he's just giving a bunch of excuses and stuff like that yeah i'm only in touch with yeah actually i i'm mostly in touch with news like this because of moist critical because i do watch him on a daily when he releases videos sometimes i do go into it but yeah i i, I saw and then actually i i, I watched his uh, moist criticals video that's how i found out a little bit more about it and then i also found out a bit more about this guy and then his uh this this guy released like a apology video like few times and deleted the rest of the videos and his newest apology video was so freaking like like so fucking pretentious it was disgusting it's very disgusting like everybody is just trying to clickbait his death and uh, it doesn't help that even in technoblade's chat itself there is people trying to spam like fake messages or uh, fake sad messages and just they just they're trying to get a freaking fast i don't know they're just, they're just trying to be uh they're just, they're just trying to get as much views as they can it's fucking disgusting <sighs> i don't know what i do do not get any to be honest Upo, i think it's best that you don't know you, you don't keep yourself in touch because the more you find out about all these things the more you feel like it's this it's just youtube is so disgusting especially i'm not, I'm not okay not all the youtubers are bad like but majority of them and, and there's one type of there's one type of channel that like like section about techno techno blade i really don't like it's those reaction techno death reactions this this genre this this right here this should not be a thing it's basically reaction channels cutting out I, I saw some see i i went and actually dig deep into it and i actually went and like see how scummy these pieces of shits are and it, they, they are fucking scum like like really scum I, I i i cannot like all this 
this a lot of this is bullshit it's i i'm not gonna say that all of it is fake but some of it a majority of it is fake like reactions to uh, like all smp members reacting to the death and then people just cut off you know stuff like that it, it, and yeah the worst part the, the worst part is all the algorithm puts these clickbaity videos on top all right and i feel like 90 percent of what we see here is so ingenuous it's so it's so fake all right you see you see i think people are making memes of his deaths so i'm not gonna look into it i don't know per se i'm not it's just my personal opinion i just feel like you know you, sh you shouldn't be making so many videos and people just hear yeah, this especially all this shit like they're just monetizing right off the bat I have not. I don't want to say. I don't want to talk too much about it. But I think if you guys, as even I think he just straight up, this guy just straight up cut Moist Criticals video. I think maybe it's easier if I just say, you know what? Yeah, I I just play the video that he talks about it so you guys can understand a bit more. Uh, I'm not gonna play the. Going to be the last video I make on this I'm not gonna topic. play the just first video. I'm gonna play the second one. A little update, a slight follow up to yesterday's video. Yesterday, I posted a video talking about the most disgusting trend on YouTube right now, and over the last 24 hours, it's gotten worse. Just like a porta potty at an EDM music festival, it just keeps getting shittier. I'll quickly go ahead and slap you with the cliff notes on the trend that I'm talking about. A beloved You've heard of it on Twitter because it's trending. Yeah, it's trending everywhere. People are making it trend because it brings in the views. That's fucked up. Okay. This is not the only guy who did this, but there's a lot of YouTube channels right now, like clickbaiting, and they all have this, like, almost this similar picture of Mr. Beast crying or whatnot. Like, I don't exactly know what the context is of this, but I don't really. But every time you click into the video, you never see a video of, like, Mr. Beast crying and stuff like that. Like, I may be wrong, but I know that a lot of people have been using Mr. Beast and then carl and like you know the you know the usual mr beast crew to make clickbait videos which is so fucked up and you if you can see it's number eight on trending but for this one at least this motherfucker got black like got literally got banned uh, that's Physical that's a win at least the shadow realm for it but he was trying i think yeah I, I mean uh techno blade did have uh, like his apparently there was a video about his dad uh talking about you know the final the final uh you know like messages he has for his viewers and also his friends and his colleagues and stuff like that i did watch the video too again i'm not really uh i, I don't really know much about technoblade i i've seen like some of his videos like i'm not really a minecraft person so i wasn't very sure and that's why i wasn't very aware of like you know all this uh, about his death and when it happened and like how people are start started like you know turning his death into content and views and stuff but luckily i found this because at least i just wanted to say my my two cents on what i think about all this this i, I don't know if you can consider them human but it's fucked up i i think the same thing happened to etika as well i i don't know if i'm pronouncing his name correctly that one i was aware of because i i i i did watch some of his content until i think he went quiet for a while and then like he was actually it was it was actually quite tragic and i think there was like people also like you know screen capping all this like death reaction to etika blah 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 you know like i i don't know what what type of moral values you have if you're going to make clips and an entire youtube video dedicated to death reactions you know like okay look i i get it if you make uh, reactions to the death of Kratos or you know the reactions to for example Sonic dies in this one you know and reactions to streamers reacting to the death of I, I don't know like 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 I, I don't know some kind of fictional character I think that's okay like fictional character like from movies or games cartoons that's okay I think it's okay to make reaction videos but death of a real person and just showing all the sad like acting like real like friends of his who were actually sad and basically just 
clipping those moments and putting it into a YouTube video and then you releasing it to the public and inside those videos of all those like streamers who on on YouTube as well actually sad and you put like subscribe if you like my content subscribe please donate blah 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 then they, they, they just gave you the entire clip of just sad people feeling actually sad for like their friend that they've actually lost and then you're here sitting and monetizing I think you're fucked you should just I, I think I think you had to I'll be honest I'm, I'm quite cynical about this but those people they have a very special place down under if there is a down under I mean I, I, I don't know I'm not gonna say so but they have a very special place down under and that's where they're going doesn't matter how much good you are you're just fucked up human being okay so I, I, I said it that, that's what I think like I, I think all these people who are just clickbaiting away and his death is just fucked up now I, I, I again you know I, I'm talking about this too I'm bringing attention to this but it's just with you guys it's just a small community it's okay and I like to sh and I want to and I like to shit talk this idiots so that's why i want to say it. that's why i want to I, I it doesn't matter what people think but i have my peace and i think these people are dog shit and have a special place down under you don't like people anymore i mean who likes people like you, you don't even know who your real friends are like i've 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 had like real life experiences of people who who i knew for years and years and then it turns out it's just freaking surface level of bullshit all right they, uh, like, I, I, okay, I'm just gonna skip through some of these. Basically, he just puts a message on screen that's like this, where he says to him that he's wait. keeping the other half to 27 I, videos today I, and posted 25. Uh, wait, this is the part. And posted this this other channel, okay, the fake. Is actually made yeah, in this one you need to hear. Me, when it's not run by one guy, it is fully monetized, and yesterday, as of yesterday, they had posted 25 videos all on the passing of Technoblade all fully monetized now they've posted up to 27 and okay this in this specifically you can tell is a is a content farm milking somebody's death now it says dream dream smt official obviously we know this is not a dream smt official they're actually quite lucky that dream didn't actually come and fucking take them down but this motherfucker right here is making so many videos over and over again about technoblade and it's all bunch of clickbait one minute videos yeah it's not it's not an official channel i know it's not official everybody knows but they but they consistently you can tell okay this is not an official channel they just got lucky because they are they use the the clickbait name of dream smp so everybody probably subscribed thinking this is a dream smp channel but it's not so that's the first red flag already and then now he's constantly posting about you know Blade death. and then he even tries to defend himself just just i'm gonna continue the video and since i'm making this video at 5 30 p.m uh, i imagine by the time this video goes up he'll probably have posted one or two more on technoblade in that time but right now they have posted 27 videos all on technoblade and his passing in yesterday's video i pulled up the discord screenshots that someone had a conversation with run along and asked him about the money he said that he's giving half of the money from the adsense to charity so up the money <laughs> how about you give it all you motherfucker okay so basically there was that part about this dream smp channel you know how scummy they can be it, it's just it has reached a point that they 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 would even defend themselves for the their scummy you know the scummy acts like obviously they would defend themselves because this is basically i would say that this person running the dream smp official channel is this is probably his job like his job is to basically make clickbait videos you know and, and like literally just monetize off of it he probably doesn't doesn't really do anything else but that like all day long i i, I really think that you know this just has says enough about that guy and you know if, if he really believed that he was doing the right thing he would have never deleted his response channel uh, his response video sorry my bad so yeah that's just you know something I, I i i i had to listen to today and it, it's just one instance there's a huge instance of other channels doing this i i i really can't you know i i, I can't believe that there's actually 
I, I mean, it's it's easy to believe nowadays that there'll be people like this outside there in the world. So maybe it's sometimes good to be a hermit. Maybe it's best that you keep it keep to yourself. You know, you have you feel like you have a better you, you feel better. You know, if you're not involved in all this shit, or if you don't listen to news like this, you you kind of it's best that you know people just stop giving this more reactions and stop giving this more attention so that all these people can die off like he's he still talks about other things down the road of like how people are making those like summoning techno blade and in like a cop circle bullshit or how and then there's some channels who also like to write like why techno blade deserve to die and like you know how his death is like it's like a controversy or whatever and it's like i remember watching one video this afternoon that was like showing a, a guy who was who was like literally saying like if you think about it technoblade isn't actually dead he's still alive but he's lying to everybody he's just quitting youtube you know you know stuff like that like like i i don't i don't give a shit if it's satire or if it's like if you're being for like real but making fun of somebody or you know just making memes out of somebody's death is just a big no-no to me and for whatever the case is this is this this shouldn't be happening so yeah I, i'm not gonna go any further i think that's a that's basically basically it you know for me just talk about this like i i i've seen a lot i think i don't want to see anymore and just let's just hope this slides i guess two people are one idiot two greedy three dumb i mean there's like there's definitely good people but then there's there's even the the good people are like maybe one out of like 10 the rest are all fucked up and i don't know i i don't know how far this is gonna go i i'm pretty sure like people are gonna start making like tiktok trends about techno blade and stuff yeah i'm not i'm not surprised if that shit start happening you know uh yeah i, I think i i'm done just let let the let the guy rest and then be over with about his boss. okay never mind let's not talk about it anymore I, I i get really really worked up i really want to say uh, more about this but i think i'm just gonna let it go because i'm just gonna get mad and rent for like the next hour there's so many ch there's a few channels that i saw today that i just want to call out like but i i think i'll just skip that anyway can, can pass me by.